Traveling is a means to success. Do subscribe travel and taste channel and like videos. For further videos stay connected. Tourist Scams in Thailand How to avoid travel scams in Thailand Thailand is a very popular tourist destination well known for its temples, beaches, nature, food and more. With an inflow of 30m foreign visitors estimated in 2023 alone, it is wise to be cautious about yourself and your belongings when traveling to Thailand to avoid falling for any scams. 11 Most Common Tourist Scams in Thailand Gemstone Scams It is where local people disguise themselves as certified gemstone sellers and sell synthetic or fake products to tourists at inflated prices. Common around, Bangkok and Chiang Mai. Tuk-tuk scams. Tuk-tuk are a common and convenient mode of transport, but tourists beware. Many tuk-tuk drivers quote a low price to travelers at the start of their trip and instead take them around shops and businesses such as gemstone sellers where they get a commission for bringing buyers around. Some tuk-tuk drivers also refuse to use the meter and charge a much higher price for the ride common around, most places in Thailand. Rigged Taxi Meter Scams This scam can begin from the time you land. Some taxi drivers charge extra if you are not careful and aware. They might refuse to go by the meter, demand extra pay, take longer routes which can increase fare price, and more. To prevent this, it is always better to be familiar with the route you have to travel or find another taxi, so you don't get scammed. Common around, airports and other entry points in Thailand. Damaged Jet Ski Scams Renters might issue faulty or damaged skis and upon return, ask the tourists to pay extra for the pre-existing damages. Some operators may also force tourists to purchase unnecessary insurance or add-ons, such as fuel charges, which can significantly inflate the rental cost. Common around, Phuket, Pattaya, Koh Samui and at beach resorts in neighborhood beaches in Thailand. Klong Scams Klong scams in Thailand occur when boat drivers charge an exorbitant fee to their passengers. Drivers might also falsely claim that tourist attractions such as the Grand Palace is closed and make several stops, sometimes at shops or vendors, where they receive commissions for bringing in customers. Common around, areas along the Jao Priya River and Grand Palace. Attraction Closed Scams in these cases, tuk-tuk drivers or tour companies trick tourists into going to places they don't want to go or weren't a part of the itinerary after pretending that the initial destination site is closed or undergoing renovations. Tourists could then be taken to businesses or stores where sellers sell overpriced goods or services such as gemstone shops, etc. common around, Bangkok, Pattaya, and Phuket. Nightlife Scams it is important to be aware and cautious about the nightlife scams in Thailand. Bars and clubs in tourist areas may overcharge for drinks, often charging tourists significantly more than locals. Pickpocketing is quite common, especially in crowded places. Clubs and bars might also stage fake police raids to extort money. If you are caught up in a raid, ask for official identification from the police and don't get worried. Common around, places like Soi Patpong, pubs and, and bars across Thailand. Pickpocketing Pickpocketers are commonly found in crowded places such as popular tourist spots, marketplaces, temples, transport, etc. They might try to steal your valuables such as phones, passports, wallets, gadgets, etc. It's better to always guard your belongings especially when you are in a crowded place. When in airports, there are chances of losing your baggage. In such situations, travel insurance with delayed or baggage loss cover can help. Common around, tourist areas and crowded places especially in urban Thailand. Tailor Tricks Tailors might pass off low quality, cheap fabric as high quality material and charge exorbitant prices for them. Before buying any piece, be sure to thoroughly check the quality of the clothes and not hurry to make a purchase. 
common around Bangkok and Pattaya. Money Exchange Scams Some money changers deceive tourists into receiving less money than they are entitled to. They either use false exchange rates, use old or torn bills, sleight of hand tricks, like palming or switching, and more to dupe tourists who want to exchange their money. Common around, Bangkok, Pattaya, and Phuket. Bird Seed Scam One common scam that occurs not only in Thailand but in other parts of the world as well is the bird seed scam. This is where local people might suggest unsuspecting tourists to feed the birds with bird food. After feeding, you might be asked to pay an amount for the bird food or even get tricked into buying bird seed. Common around, tourist areas around the Grand Palace. How to avoid travel scams in Thailand. First things first, it is important to avail of travel insurance to Thailand before you set off on your journey so you know your finances will be safe and protected in case an unexpected event or situation arises. You must take precautions when visiting a foreign country. Do subscribe travel and taste channel and like videos. For further videos stay connected.